YouTube family, welcome back and welcome back. What you say? You still in your underwear? Oh, those underwears. Okay, so somebody try to have me promote these scented underwears. Um, all right. So today we're gonna be making turkey wings, and can you believe the price on these turkey wings? It's two for like seven bucks. Seven bucks. I might as well go buy a meal, come with a side and a drink, right? And it's already cooked for me. But that's the way life is right now. Groceries are high, especially meat. Everything is just so expensive. So we're just gonna make two. We're gonna start off by preheating our oven. Oh, All right, we're gonna preheat it to 375 and we are gonna get the washing on these turkey wings. So we're gonna transfer them to a bowl, white vinegar, and just clean them. These wings are actually pretty big. It has the whole flap. I can't wait to eat this skin part, delicious. Come with the drum part. Maybe I should cut it. Should we cut it? Let's cut it. All right, so let's chop it. We're gonna chop it right here. And boom, we separate it in. Put it back in our big bowl that we're gonna use to wash it. All right, here's the other part. Cut it right here. One chop, boom, bang, bang, boom. Okay, let's go watch. Well, y'all know dresses get stuck so much. Oh, it's bouncing though. You see that? This is YouTube, family friendly. <laughs> All right, let's go watch this. Okay. So I got my turkey wings in here and I'm gonna take some bleach. It's like no, white vinegar oh my. and pour it in there sparingly. And we're gonna take our lemon. I'm gonna scrub it. Let's clean out that turkey gook. All right, we're gonna let that sit for like three minutes and then we're gonna rinse it out, okay? Just let that sit. All right, our chicken is washed and now it's time for the seasoning, okay? Whatever seasoning you want. I don't have any pineapple teriyaki that I normally like, but we're just gonna do what All we All right, do. so we are gonna start out with some paprika. We're gonna coat the top and then we'll rub it in. So make sure you do it sparingly so that you can have some for the other side. Some garlic and parsley powder. We're gonna do some Louisiana Cajun. Some seasoned salt. Some onion powder. <coughs> and some accent. <coughs> Ew, excuse me. Some black pepper. <coughs> and some crushed red peppers. <laughs> okay so this is what our chicken i mean our turkey should look like and then we're gonna pour some olive oil all right and then we're gonna get this good mix we're gonna massage it. put on gloves wash your hands i don't have gloves right now so Oh, it's a chicken, so it's seasoning on both sides. Yeah, 
All right, once that is done, let's get our an onion cut up. Make sure it's everywhere. All right. Let's go wash our hands. All right, now we got an onion and let's cut this up. I'm actually gonna use some of this onion for our cabbage too. Okay. All right, now we're gonna take that onion and we're gonna put it around the sides. Couple on top. And we got this good chicken broth right here, okay? The soup, yeah! The Vietnamese chicken broth is very flavorful. Babe, can you open this? Thank you. And here you got me, um, Gonna, um, uh, aluminum foil. So we're going to take the soup and we're going to pour it around the edges, not on top of the chicken. In the corner, like this. All right, and now we're going to wrap it up in aluminum foil. It's burning my eye. Add more of this, more Cajun on here. Okay. <laughs> Alright, now we're gonna cover it. Seal it tight. Put it in the oven for about 40 minutes and then we'll Alright, I got some cabbage that I have already cut up some earlier and so now we're just gonna you can do whatever shape size you like big pieces you can cut it in big pieces put in a strainer my onions in a strainer too so I guess it's gonna get washed too Take this and wash it in the sink, okay? Cold water. All right, so we got some butter we're gonna put in our pan, and I got some bacon. So, this is some leftover bacon grease from breakfast today. We're gonna scoop some out. This is gonna melt in there with the butter. Just a spoonful of garlic. Fresh is better, but I'm lazy, so that's what we're gonna get. Bacon grease, butter, garlic. All right, as soon as that melt, we're gonna take our washed cabbage and we're gonna start adding it into here. Thank you. 
And the cabbage is going to cook down, so you can add it as it cooks down. It's just going to overflow it a lot. The onions are down here, too. Add our onions in there. Sure, we get our butter and our bacon all on each pieces. that cook down will come back back once it cook down to season it all right time to season some garlic and parsley powder some onion powder some seasoned salt a little bit of accent and some crushed red peppers some black pepper Good stir. And we're going to add some balsamic vinegar. Ta da! And add some of this seasoning sauce, soy sauce, I call it soy sauce, whatever. If you like it with some crunch, you don't have to cook as low, as long to leave some crunch. I'm gonna cook it for a little bit more because I like a little crunch, but not too hard. But I don't like it all the way cooked. I don't like it soggy. All right, so I, it's been like 40 minutes, so we're gonna open it and base it. Do it smell good? I love the smell of turkey. Bring me back to Thanksgiving. And we're gonna close it. We're gonna crank it up. I'm sorry, my nail was in the way. We're gonna crank it up to 400, and then we're gonna let it sit in there longer. What's the matter? Just hay fever. Okay, so it's been like another 30, and this part is totally optional. You do not have to do this part, um, but. Baby, can you open this? <laughs> totally optional. You can just add some flour, make a little roux, but I'm gonna add this gravy in here. Baby, can you open it up? Oh, you found the honey buns. Oh shit, I banged with too much. I need you over here where the sauce is. Okay. Mix it in there with that stuff right there. Okay. And we're gonna close this really tight this time because I didn't really make it tight. Oh, I'm over here recording the wrong part.
Okay, close this for another like 30, 40 minutes. Okay, this is, if it's not done, it's gonna fucking be done now because this is why I don't like baking until everything takes up. Anyways, so we're gonna take this off and this what we're gonna do. We is going to, you know, put it on top and then we're gonna, we're gonna turn the, ow, hot shit, god damn it. I'm gonna fucking look trash shit. Okay. Look at that thing. Ow, that big fat thing. Ooh. Mm, that smell good though. I ain't gonna lie. This bitch. Ow, shit, hot. All right. We're gonna turn the boiler on for like a couple minutes. All right. So, this is what it looks like sizzling hot. So here is our cabbage and white rice. Yeah. Ah! Shit. Look at that. I make it look sexy. Now the rice is all over the place. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> Try it again. All right. Now we're going to pour our gravy on top with the onions. And let's hit the um the rice too. And yeah. Mm. Sprinkle a little crushed red peppers on here. Mm. Why don't we? Wherever it is. Ah, here it is. Oh yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right, now we feed it to our kids and let them try it. Thank you. I'm gonna take my tooth out. Amen. Mmm. So let's see if the wing, if the meat is falling apart. And it is. It's falling right off the bone. Mm. The rice is good. The sauce is good? Mm -hmm. I think it's the meat. Mm. Taboo. Mm -hmm. I like the skin. Eat this, but I want, I want it to cool down. Puppy. See, I like the crunch. Can you sit? No. Sit. No, sit. Yes, sit. Good boy. Food patrol. Took a long time to cook, but it was worth it. Thank you. Mmm. Mmm, splash. Mm. I like the sauce. I love the sauce. Mmm. -hmm. Look how the skin does. Pulls off. Can we do this again? Mm hmm. Yummy. All right, I hope you guys try this. Make sure you check out the kids' YouTube too. What did it do? Two space day, A Y Y. Until next time. Bye bye. bye.